Gemini friends, welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. I hope you guys are all doing well. So this is going to cover the next two weeks for your weekly readings for each sign. I go live every Wednesday between 7 o'clock, 7.30 Eastern Standard Time, USA. You guys could um, definitely feel free to catch me live there. Or even watch the replay. Definitely, definitely can resonate. Even if you're not in the chat. So this is going to be for Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising Signs. And please just keep in mind, Gemini, you know, that I am reading for a lot of you. So please take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Feel free to watch your other signs. I am using just the um, Radiant Rider Weight Tarot deck. Gemini, Spirit, Sun, Moon, and Rising Signs. March 18th to the 31st, 2019 for Gemini. Your cards feel good. Gemini, those of you that would like to get a private reading, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Instant Go. Links to everything that you guys need are right below the video in the description box. That's going to be your overall energy. Okay, and at the bottom of the deck is the Knight of Cups. So if this is love, some of you definitely could have some exciting, loving communication, news, something that's going to make you happy. You know, and especially if it's love, I always see the Knight of Cups as someone that you already know. You know, someone from the past coming back. And it definitely could be very unexpected. Totally out of the blue. Oh my God. The Six of Cups is under there too. Yeah, you're definitely dealing with water sign energy. Three of Cups and then the Sun. But this is definitely someone from the past. Wow. Or something from the past. And it's a big shock. Hmm. Uh, like really very un unexpected. You know, this person definitely could just be literally coming in and proposing to you. And it's a complete big shock. A huge surprise. And I probably just ruined it. I think I'm so sorry. Like someone literally could be even just asking you out. Even here, it could be an ex-friend with the Three of Cups. It could be, in a, you know, a friend, someone in your inner circle. Definitely someone that you know. And you're starting out with, well, your overall energy is the Ten of Pentacles. You know, big family, big money. Some of you definitely could be spending time with family. You know, for some of you, it's definitely a big financial opportunity coming in. Like financially, things really look amazing over the next two weeks. It's abundance. 
it's happiness, and it's really feeling stable and secure. And you could be dealing with an Aries or a Taurus male. Be your partner, your spouse, friend, family member. Could even be a father. Like you could literally, definitely with the Six of Swords, be traveling to go see this person, them, you. I mean, there's definitely travel here for some of you with the Six of Swords, the Chariot. You know, and, and really, especially when I have the Ten of Pentacles and the Tower in the same spread. Some of you definitely could be moving to a new home. You know, it could even be that your father is moving in with you. Vice versa, you're moving in with your father. Or moving in with your family. So an Aries, a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces could be important. And the Chariot is the ultimate victory and success card. And I, I really do feel like with the Ten of Pentacles, this move... Gemini is very, very good for you. Very good for you. You know, moving, you know, always what I, I say with this card, you know, moving from shitty times to much more better times, you know, peace and harmony. And with this moving or traveling, I just feel like things are going to be so much better for you. Because you're definitely feeling emotionally tired, exhausted. Some of you could have gone through a loss. Like just some difficulties, challenges. You know, but you're absolutely not, you know, giving up, backing down, giving in. Some of you could have gone through a breakup. Unfortunately, and you know, that could be why you're moving. But you're definitely not giving up. Some of you are either moving forward with your life, others of you could be moving to a new home. And the Knight of Pentacles can be you just, you know, taking your time, going at your own pace. And definitely listening to your intuition. You know, when it comes to this, especially for those of you that are receiving a financial offer or opportunity, And I do really, with the tower and the high priestess next to each other, I really do feel like some of you are hearing something, receiving something. You know, it could even be information. And it's just quick, very, very suddenly. You know, for those of you that are, you know, partnered, you know, married... That, you know, they could be popping up, offering you something. They might want to travel or move. Uh, others of you could be getting into a committed relationship. You could definitely be committing to someone. 
It could be moving in together for the first time and it's exciting. It's definitely someone from your past. Definitely. I'm totally convinced of that. And it's a friend. For sure. And it's happiness. You have happiness here. And then the sun is under here too, Gemini. Or Leo. Or your children, like your family. Definitely traveling for some of you, definitely. I mean, whatever it is, it's beautiful. So this is what I'm going to do. I am going to pull you guys an Oracle card. But I'm also going to, for the women, Bad Bitches Tarot. Like advice, an advice card. And then for the men, because that's more for the women. It is a women deck. It is a women tarot deck. One from the Gilded. I know, my voice is shot. Definitely tonight. It's definitely shot. Okay, additional items for Gemini. 18th to the 31st of March. For Gemini. Gemini. Okay, that's a jumper. These are by Ethany. Ethany. She is here on YouTube and um, also Instagram. Beautiful deck. Very beautiful. Notice that. Sorry, guys. Gemini men. That's a first. Gemini men. Say what the oracle card is. Independent. Your independence is a foundation of your strength and success. Wow. Some of you have definitely had to fight, you know, to be strong with having to wait. You know, this is definitely a card of waiting on something for a long time. And, and it definitely because things have been moving, you know taking their sweet ass time moving slowly but this night's always successful they always reach their goal and you are but things are definitely things were moving very slowly you know with the tower card the chariot Definitely, and the Eight of Wands for the women. Definitely sudden, unexpected. Things are just going to start happening. And it's allowing for things to happen and finally move forward for you. Literally. 
But ladies, I mean, the Eight of Wands, movement, fast, I mean, just these two cards together are very quick, fast-paced, moving energies, things happening quickly, suddenly. Um, and everything is in line for you, too. You know, this is a universal force. So, and even with this card in this deck, you know, everything is aligned for you to move forward. Like, it's a, a universal force to just go for it. It's like a car. It's like act now, move now, take that new opportunity, offer now. Um... You know, that old saying, it's a saying, you know, if you don't act now, you don't win. Right? That's the advice. Like, definitely move. Put a move on it. I like it in this card. You look happy, too. And the men have the Nine of Pentacles. Wow. Just like the independent card. So you guys are definitely happy being single, happy being independent. You know, and you've worked very hard for everything you have. You know, it's being self-reliant. You know, it's about literally take the time, you know, especially if you're a business owner, you know, to take the time, you know, to be comfortable with your own company, enjoy your freedom. And if you're already married in a partnership, you know, with that three of cups being under there, it definitely could be a time. Oh, well, this is for men. I was going to say a girl's night out, but. You know, even get out with the guys. You know, get some space from your partner. A little bit. If it's money, you're definitely making smart investment choices, decisions. Like you're seeing the efforts of your work coming in. Literally, even though things have been moving slow as shit, definitely things coming in for you, an offer Little, from the nine right to the ten. It's amazing. Really nice. Love it, Gemini. Love you guys. Hope the reading helps you out some way shape or form if not you know definitely feel free to watch your other signs i love you guys have a beautiful um two weeks if you follow me for facebook live i will see you wednesday if not i will see you guys back here very soon for your monthlies take care guys